This is America Movie Corp production. Today I will be discussing Chapter 11, Section 3, which deals with online mapping. Online mapping is the compilation and publication of websites that provide exhaustive graphical and text information in the form of maps and databases. The convenience that comes from this IT system is the fact that it is all online and can be accessed by anyone at any time. Plus, all the information you needed is compiled right there for you. If you really think about it, we use online mapping services on a daily basis. Online mapping services are used for tasks such as planning trips, determining geographical positions, finding landmarks and businesses, obtaining addresses and phone numbers, and even plotting storm tracks. You may even use Siri, which is she helps you with a lot of the online mappings if you're looking for it's all voice automated so you just say the command and then you get it all right how do these work uh, queries upon queries of complex geographics traffic patterns and many other information containing the logic of places are compiled into databases and then when you search for these they are all pulled up from each of the queries, which queries are essentially uh, a series of databases with a series of different information. And they're all compiled and pulled for you. Like it says in the article, some examples include uh, the ability to know the no left turns, uh, know where the freeway on ramps are, s speed limits, and where they change, as well as traffic conditions. These are just a few examples of the major companies or websites with extensive online mapping services. Um, many of these, if not all of these providers, have made their services available on mobile devices, uh, iPhones with the Google Maps, and many people just uh, on desktops use MapQuest. Yahoo's an upcoming one, and Google Earth's great for searching physical geographical landmarks. Next, we have the social ethical concerns. Uh, social ethical, ethical concerns in, for this particular IT system include reliability, integrity, and surveillance. When it comes to reliability, we're talking about the accuracy of the maps. Uh, that means landmarks, buildings, roads, they should all be proportional to each other uh, as if you were looking at them in real life. Um, integrity, that focuses more on the information that is in, in the IT system, that means more or less with the databases that all the inf that process the information you see should all be correct. That is that highways should be, um, the highway patterns should all be corresponding with each other. Um, data, and with the integrity, data needs to be constantly updated and recalculated in order to maintain that um, accuracy. Surveillance, that is more or less with the imaging that comes with the online mapping. Uh, people don't like the fact that stuff, programs like Google Earth has the ability to zoom in so close and be so accurate. Because you can zoom into somebody's backyard, uh, their homes, offices, their cars. I know Google had to change the policy and block out all of the license plates because you could zoom in and read their license plates. Well, thank you for watching. Once again, this was America Movie Production.